In this problem, we are being asked to square this binomial. And it has more than one variable, but that shouldn't give us any trouble. When you square a binomial, when you square anything, you multiply it by itself. So we could rewrite this as 5y plus 6w times 5y plus 6w. And then we can just apply FOIL, where you multiply the first terms, the outside terms, the inside terms, and then the last terms. And then you combine any like terms. So let's go ahead and try that. 5y times 5y. Well, the 5 times 5 is 25. y times y is y squared. So that gives us 25y squared. The outside term, 5y times 6w. So the 5 times 6 is 30. The y times the w, I'm just going to write as wy. doesn't matter which order. I'm just using alphabetical. The inside terms, 6w times 5y, that's another 30wy. And the outside terms, 6w times 6w, 6 times 6 is 36, and w times w is w squared. So these are like terms. So they'll add up to 60wy. And we have 25 y squared plus 60 wy plus 36 w squared. The shortcut, if you want to think about it, is the first term is the first term squared, the last term is the second term squared, and the middle term is going to be multiply these two together and then double it. So when you're squaring a binomial, that's a shortcut you may want to keep in, in hand, but foiling is always going to work for you.